Hi guys, my name is Gina Jamesville and welcome to the Class Clown Hobby Event. This hobby event begins as soon as you complete the teacher's pet quest and we have seven days for this. You will get this pop up as soon as you do complete that quest. It says detention plus an empty school can lead to one learning outcome. Clowning around, complete the Class Clown Hobby to unlock all the rooms of Downtown High. So click on go to hobby to get started on this and here is the grid. So as I said we have got seven days and this hobby is worked slightly different to the other hobbies in that there is levels but the levels don't really matter. So what you need to do is there's four different rooms. There's an English room, a home ec room, a computer lab and a science lab and each one of these grids will unlock the next room if that makes sense so you need to go into the English room and find three different collectibles and then you will unlock the home ec room and then the next line that we can't actually access at the moment you can see that they're greyed out you can collect them by doing the hobby in the home ec room the home ec will unlock the computer lab room you build the computer lab room and then we go on to the next line of the grid so to get started, just click on the exclamation mark and we have English Clown 3 hours and 30 minutes. You can only have one sim in each classroom, so if you try and do it with another sim, it will come up saying, sorry, no can do, a sim is already engaged in this action. So first time round, you can only have one sim doing this hobby. So I'm going to leave my sim doing the English Class Clown and I'm going to try and collect the first three collectibles. You can get adults or teenage sims to do this hobby if you want. They are the only age phases that can complete this hobby. You probably are going to get repeats with this. If you get repeats, obviously you can use this Lucky Spin for LP. Generally, I don't think I would recommend it. I would just recommend just keep on going. And yeah, you're going to repeat. It's just one of those things. They do it just to annoy us, I think. But you'll eventually you will get the three that you need and then you can unlock the next room, which is the home ec room. You need to keep being the English clown until you have completed the first set. So congratulations, you completed the first set. As you can see now, we have unlocked the home ec. So we now have access to the second row and we can collect the second row. So here is the next classroom open. Wow, look at this home ec class. So now we can do, we've got the option for English Clown, which we don't need to do because obviously we've already collected the three collectibles that we can get for the English Clown. We need to do the Home Ec Clown for three hours and 30 minutes. We continue doing the Home Ec Clown until we have gathered these three collectibles in that row. There we go, that is second set complete. So as you can see, we finished the second row. So we now unlock the computer lab. So here's the computer lab and we can now go in there and now we've got computer lab clown which has been added which is also 3 hours and 30 minutes so we can start that and by collecting those we will get these three collectibles on this row which will unlock the science lab for us. And here is the last collectible in the third set. So we've completed the third row now and we've unlocked the science lab. So we need to go into the science lab now and collect these final three. So the science lab is unlocked next door here. So click on that and we need to science lab clown for three hours and 30 minutes until we have collected all three of the science lab collectibles. Congratulations, you have completed the fourth set and congratulations, you've won the cheerleader outfits limited time prize. Hit the wardrobe or grab a pair of pom-poms and get your cheer on. So we have unlocked the second floor of Downtown High, which you get just for completing the Class Clown Hobby. You don't have to complete it within the time limit to win that. And as you can see, we have got a completed grid here of the Class Clown Hobby. You can start a new collection. If you start a new collection, the next time you complete the collection, you will win two LPs. But let's take a look at the prizes. The cheerleader outfit prizes are for male and female sims, teenagers and adults. So just go into a wardrobe and in the outfit section is where you will find the cheerleaders outfits. And we have six different colours, both for male and for female. I think possibly this kind of maroony yellow one is my favourite. So let's put her in that. And for the male, 
we have colour schemes that match the female version so that obviously matches the one that I've just put my female sim in and then we have these other five colours as well they're pretty cool let's put him in the matching outfit back over at downtown high and we have our sims that are dressed as cheerleaders and there are pom-poms on the field and we can perform routine for two hours and 30 minutes so we'll try that now with them can we have someone join yes we can join in 10 minutes so we've got a female and a male sim over at the <laughs> oh, look at that cheerleading oh it would be so cool if we could get i wonder if we can get like loads of them joining in together like i've just got one joining in at the moment he hasn't got pom-poms why has he not got pom-poms dude Okay, this guy isn't dressed up as a cheerleader, but he can join in as well. Let's just whistle a few sims over and test this out. Can we get a load joining in? I feel like, yeah, we can. They only join in for 10 minutes, so she's going to go for 2 hours and 30. And this crowd is just, oh, but then they change into the outfit. Oh wow, look at that. Only the girls get the pom pom. I suppose, is that in real life? Is that what happens with cheerleading? I don't know, I don't really know much about cheerleading. But do just the girls get the pom poms? No idea. Look, oh my goodness, look at them. That's classic. There you go, guys. Anyway, I'm just, <laughs> just watching them. I wish they would do other moves. If they could get like some new, like if they made a pyramid, that would be awesome. Am I asking a lot? Probably. But that's pretty cool. I love that. There is the class clown hobby, guys. It shouldn't be too difficult. You only have to complete the hobby once, can fill out the whole grid once to win the cheerleading outfits. If you do keep getting repeats, I mean, I got a ton of repeats whilst I was doing it and still managed to complete within plenty of time without using many LPs. In fact, I couldn't, wouldn't need to have used any LPs, to be honest. I finished it with maybe six days left. It only took me like two days using a couple of LPs. So yeah, you can definitely do this within the time limit. Good luck with it. Let me know what you think of the outfits and the whole kind of downtown area in general. Oh my goodness, I just remembered. Upstairs, we didn't even check that out. That's what the, we won from completing the hobby. Is that we get the principal's office and staff room, which takes five hours to build. And then math class, three hours, and social science class, three hours. It always makes me laugh like Americans say math. From, in, from the UK, we say maths, like the plural, like mathematics. Americans say math. I don't know, it just, it's weird. I find that weird anyway. But uh, yeah, that's what we won. We won the upper floor. So I'm going to go ahead and build the upper floor now. And we have a completed high school. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think. Oh, look at them in the background. I just love it. Let me know what you think. I will see you guys soon for a new video. Don't forget, don't forget to give this one a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Bye.